Good morning, friends. It's Stephen Walashik from Prime Lending. Today's Tuesday. It's August 30th, and that means it's time for Tuesday's Two Minute Tip. Uh, over the past couple of weeks, I've had several customers and realtors that I've spoken with that have expressed some frustration. A uh, common theme has been, uh, I've talked to three different lenders, and I've got three different answers. Or lender ABC said this, or lender XYZ says that. Um, folks, there's a reason why you can talk to three different lenders and get three different answers. There's a number of reasons. Number one, we don't all have the same products. Uh, some lenders will allow financing on manufactured homes. Others won't. Those who do sometimes put restrictions as far as credit score, etc. cetera. Uh, FHA allows for a credit score of 580 for 3.5% down payment, but very few lenders actually will do that. They'll put a minimum requirement of a 640 or a 620 credit score. And if it's below 640, some lenders will put overlays on top of that. Also, uh, for conventional loans, you have two main investors on the secondary market, Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac. Some lenders will sell exclusively to one or the other. Some will sell to both. There's actually seven pages of differences between Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac on how uh, much you have to use for student loan debt. Freddie Mac actually allows for income-based repayment Almost all other student loan programs require 1% minimum. So Freddie Mac is a little bit more lenient. It's also private road agreements, number of investment properties you own, et cetera, et cetera. There's also lenders that do portfolio where they hold it in-house so they can hold on to a non-warrantable condo until it's a saleable product. Or they may come up with their own 100% financing program. This is why I try to meet with at least two lenders every month from different institutions. See, I like to play nice. I'm aware that we don't have all the solutions. No lender does. But having an awareness of what the other folks have in the market allows me to best serve my customers. So don't be frustrated if you get three different answers when you talk to three different lenders. It's very common. The important piece, especially for you millennials, is not to trust Google to have the definitive answer. Call your local mortgage professional and find out what the answer to the question is. I'm Stephen Walushik from Prime Lending. That's Tuesday's tip. I thank you for tuning in, hitting like, sharing, commenting, etc. And as always, make it a great day.